Hey everyone, hope you were able to have a great spring semester. Today, I was hoping to bring up the concerning issues now about you just stop the right movie. there, you no good hippy dippy city boy. I don't need you or anyone else's brand of fake news to tell me about how my news sources are completely false. That is just not the type of hooting and hollering I will accept. Say it. Oh, please. Like you know anything about what's really going on. It's because of you people that our country is in like some predicament in the first place. Ugh. I knew there was a reason I stopped talking to you. How does that window get there? You know, it's a treatment from you people like yourself that make this quote high and mighty unquote that just makes me feel so angry that you just think you're so better than everyone else just because you support one party over the other. We do it soon. As well as call me dumb because I'm trying to support my local businesses, it's hard enough trying to find work in this stupid small town due to the fact that most of the businesses are shipped over some cheaper locations where taxes are avoided. To which the tax fix made the richer richer and you poorer. See? This is what I'm talking about. This is why I can't stand being around you. You've looked down on me ever since I brought that sweet potato pie instead of the pumpkin pie at Thanksgiving three potato? years ago. You I just thought that it tasted potato? better than Ugh. pumpkin pie, and I just prefer the taste of potato. You think about Why is that such a bad every idea? Every time I go with you, I don't want to have pumpkin pie. Every time I see you year after year it's after the same year, thing over and, and over still, again. you complain to me about left how. Right. Now they're going to be fighting for a while, so let me state my two cents on the matter. I'm an adult, bi, white male with a history of bottled up feelings that has a view on both sides of the argument, mainly from home and school. And the way that we're consuming our media is digging a hole so deep that it's hard to find the human element behind it. Now, sources from the right tend to play into people's fears to keep them watching, while sources on the left tend to play into people's self-righteousness over those from the right. Now, this won't change if there isn't some financial game to come from it. Fox News' Hannity program has advertisements for weight loss, protection from scammers, and portable air, while CNN's Anderson Cooper has advertisements for cell phones, finding to see if you're related to a slave owner, and the perfect pillow for your studio apartment. And this says a lot about the content that they're producing. Hey, hey, I, I know you're just worried about where this is going, and you're just trying to explain it to me, but it's just hard feeling like I made a bad decision. I'm sorry for yelling at you. No, no, I, I should be the one who should have understood that Change for a lot of people is scary and hard to adjust to. I'm, I'm sorry. At least there's no money involved in both our cases. I feel like a war could have broken out. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel right to cause bloodshed over such a petty disagreement. Wanna go watch cartoons? Okay, I'll be right up. Now, I'm not going to be the one that's going to stand here and brainwash you into doing any of this. But you may know someone with a different opinion than you. Or they get all their info from the internet. But you just got to remember, everyone can make a mistake. Even you, the person watching this video. Oh, and the title of this video was Bias in the Media. How Discrediting Other People Discredits Ourselves. Peace.